Charge activated. Synchronizing retransmission chronosity. Contact engaged. Shenji 've more than made up for killing my abductors Mistios. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Try to stay out of trouble, all right? I'll consider it. Put my coins to good use and wish good me luck. luck. Mm. Oh, by the way. Oh. Hey, how are you? I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Need something? I found some fantastic valuables today, Mistios. Real riches. I need to deliver them to my sister to sell at the market. But bandits lie in wait for visitors to the city. So you want me to gut every single bandit? That's right. Sounds like you can stop worrying. I've taken care of everything. Job well done, mercenary. Here, this is yours. Happy to help. <laughs> ah, the Delos Islands, two sides of the same coin. Delos, sacred birthplace of Artemis and Apollo. And Mykonos, where people do everything that's forbidden on Delos. Read me the note again. Eagle-bearing Mystios. That's you. Otharkis, cruel leader of Delos Islands, takes money from our pockets and food from our mouths, all to feed his... Inset... Inseti... Insatiable. Yes! His... Insatiable thirst for power. Odarkis is one of them, Barnabas. The ones hunting my family. Keep reading. We are a modest but fierce group of rebels who'd pay you handsomely to help us overthrow our vile oppressor. I pray the winds guide you swiftly to our shores, Mistios. Our people are dying. Signed, Kira. Hmm, Hada. 我是来对付。I should go. There is work to be done. Gods forbid we enjoy a single moment on this glorious beach. Does the note say where Kira is? There are two locations marked. A camp along the northwestern coast and a hideout that looks like it's underneath the city. Odarki sounds like a cruel man. It's worse. I once heard a family was late in paying their dues to the gods. Potharki sent his men to their farm and took the young ones from their beds. When their mater and pater woke up to feed the animals, they discovered the animals were already feeding on the corpses of their sons. The sooner I send this monster to Hades, the better. Even Hades would shudder in his presence. It's time I met with this Kira. I'll have the ship ready in case we need any... 
immediate departures. That was Kefalonia, and that was mostly your fault. <laughs> Here, Cassandra. Here, Juarnavas. I'm looking for the one called Kira. I've come in response to a call for help. <laughs> you missed. Are you here to spy, Athenia? Or maybe you are Athena herself, dressed in a dirty disguise? Do I really look like a spy to you? Podarkis and his men have been hunting and killing us without mercy. His spies are everywhere. He won't rest until all who oppose him are dead. We are all that's left of the resistance. This is the first night we aren't fighting for our lives. And it could be our last. And suddenly, you show up. This is why I'm here. It's your symbol, right? You're the Mystios who bears the Eagle of Zeus. My apologies. These are dangerous times for anyone waging war against the Athenian Empire and the Delian League. I am Kira. Your note mentions Podarkis. I'm going to find him. His house is on the coast, uh, north of Mykonos city. But he's heavily guarded. We've never been able to get close enough without taking heavy casualties. This is why I sent for you. Mm, okay. I came here to help you deal with one man, not go to war. Which is why I sent word of a rebellion to the mighty Cassandra, and Sparta too. But oh. discovered the other cap and sent Athenian soldiers to attack. Malaka! You and your rebels are too drunk to fight. Leave the soldiers to me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you think I'm going to miss a chance to kill Athenians, you're the one who's drunk. So, so, so. <laughs> oh, for the room. So, see, I didn't. Wow. Well, Kira. You too, Spartan? Yep. Shut up. I was, but that was a long time ago. Spartan blood is eternal, stranger. What's your name? This is Cassandra, the one I told you about. They call me Thaletas. I was Polemarchos to the Spartans here. Was? <laughs> Our ship was sunk. Our generals killed. There are only a few of us left. Oh. We've all lost friends to this war.
and we will mourn them later. She's right. We shouldn't be standing here drenched in Athenian blood. We'll be safe in the hideout. Let's talk there. Will you come to the hideout now, or meet us there later? There's no time to waste. We'll go to the hideout now. How long till Podarkis finds us? We're right under his nose! His nose is so high in the air, he couldn't find the statue of Artemis Agrotera if he was standing on her head! We know where he lives! I say we knock down his door and run our spears through his face! That's a terrible plan! The Spartan phalanx is impenetrable in a ground assault! Not when there's only twelve of you! You think with your heart! That's what I like about you! But you're a general! To those men now, you need to think with your head! All you do is hide in caves and lurk in shadows. We didn't come here to hide. We came here to fight! And we will. But right now we're outnumbered. We must be strategic. Cassandra, what do you think we should do? Hmm. I like the way the Spartan thinks. But we don't have enough swords to fight them head on. What do you suggest? When I arrived, I saw Spartan ships. Can we get a message to them? Not while the Athenian navy surrounds these islands. We need those reinforcements. I got the two of you here to actually help the rebellion, not to send more people to their deaths! Kira, wait! While the two of you compare swords, I'll be at the Temple of Artemis, making an actual plan. Just fight. I like it. I'm going back to my camp and my men. Meet me and we'll discuss reinforcements. Here. Oh, this is going to be a long rebellion. Cassandra, I'm glad you came. Are you? I lost my temper in the cave. I'm sorry. First you throw a knife at me, then you storm out. I'm starting to take it personally. <laughs> I know, I know. I feel terrible. You came all this way and I've been nothing but cruel. Well, you weren't the first, and you won't be the last. Villians are kind people. At least we were. Before him. Podarkis. That man's been hunting me my whole life. Hmm. Podarkis and others like him want me and my family dead. He executed my family when I was very little. I survived on the streets. ...was raised by hunters, rogue warriors, and mercenaries like you. They are my family now. And one day, I will fire an arrow into his black heart. One for every Dillian family he's destroyed! Then it's time we turn this predator into prey. How do we get past his guards? Soldiers need two things to fight. Swords in their hands, and food in their bellies. Take them away, and the guards fall. Scouts reported Podarkis' supplies and weapons were stockpiled in the old ruins on Delos Island. I'll go to Delos, find their stockpiles, and destroy them. Oh, shit. Oh, I have to go to that one. Break their supplies, break their will. That should do it. Kira will want to hear about this. And? Is it done? Povarkis' guards will have to fight with their fists and on empty stomachs from now on. Excellent. So, what will you do once Podarkis is dead and the Rebellion is won? The sad truth is, I have no idea. For as long as I can remember, every day has been a struggle. To live, to love... Vengeance has all but consumed me. And what will Cassandra do once this is over? Wow. We have a lot in common. I was... Hoping when the smoke clears, we could find somewhere quiet. And what exactly do we have in common? Mm. 
I know you've struggled to get where you are. You've had to fight and claw for everything you have. I know, because I've done the same. We're survivors. I'm glad the gods brought you to our source, Cassandra. Some time alone would be nice. You must have many tales. It's time we got going. When Poparkis learns of what happened on Dilos, he'll want revenge. And the first to suffer will be the Dillians. Here. Neil Stina. <laughs> What I did, I did for the glory of Thelos. You acted alone, and you will die alone. Eagle Bearer, my name is Herodianos, second to Thaletas in battle. The dogs of war howl for blood. And thanks to you, Sparta now howls back. Sounds like a lot of howling. Fight with us! Together we'll run our shields through their skulls and spears through their hearts! Okay. I'd be honored to fight with Sparta. To battle! A bad day for Athens! A glorious day for Sparta! <laughs>
やー我没有离开战斗区域啊是他自己跑到那么远的怪嘿嘿再回来再回来一点再回来一点嘿这差哦再见这就光没了赶紧逃吧五五两万一的经验值还可以哦Sandra, you're back. Got to run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at the Sometimes I think you are too much like me. Friends, I know you're angry. And you have the right to be. Why do they hide in their houses? Aspasia. Oh, Cassandra. You returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's as loud as a battlefield out there, and as violent. They're calling for Pericles' head, as though he should know how to handle this catastrophe. No one is prepared for the end of the world. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother. Her name, her ship... Cassandra, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. Pericles is a strong man. I'm sure he can fight the sickness. You heard the mob. He can't defend himself. He'll die with no glory. Athens has known him a lot longer than they've known this plague. He gave them a voice. His accomplishments will speak for him. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Told you. It's Cassandra. Yes. Come in. It's embarrassing. Someone so strong seeing me like this. I admit you don't quite look yourself. I don't feel like myself either. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses no favorites. 
I fear I've failed Athens. Its people, Anaspasia. No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind, but I've lost. Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena, but it seems it isn't so. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. The gods definitely aren't in Athens. I hardly recognize it here. It's like the Tartarus. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon. My greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Cassandra. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. Pericles let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about the ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. Did Pericles tell you what I said about the cult in Athens? This cult? I thought it was his sickness speaking for him. It's true. But Phoebe's smart. She knows the way back. I hope so. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasius' house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Here. By the gods! What happened here? Demos must be carrying through on his threat. This was savage. Done to send a message. I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here. Hopefully she's safe. Mother of all, I greet you. Aniazu. Cassandra! Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. 
We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Cassandra! Yeah. I'm sorry, Phoebe. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with her. I agree, my friend. I agree. There you are, Cassandra. Quickly, Pericles may be inside. What's gotten into you? Phoebe was killed by cult guards before I could get to her. Oh, no. Dear Phoebe. She died alone in the street. No, you found her. She wasn't alone. I know how much of a friend she was to you. I won't let them get away with this. You have to fight for her. Aspasia, you're here. Any sign of Pericles? If he's here, he's inside praying. He refused to stay safe in the villa. Things have gotten even worse in the Agora. It's madness. Speak later and act now, Pericles. Go! I'm going to destroy everything you ever created. Athens is mine. Pericles! Out of my way. is lost now. He was a great man. Perhaps greater than we even knew. We need to get her out of Athens. We'll take my ship. We have to leave. Don't let him die in vain. Never. Cleon has ordered that no one leave Athens. And he wants Aspasia brought to him. I'm not going. Leave! Don't let them go. Shut <laughs> going to stay, Cassandra. What? Why? My work is here. I can't leave the Athenians in the state they're in. You don't need us to protect Aspasia. Leave Athens to us. You saw what happened to Pericles. You want the same to happen to you? If every dissenting voice disappears, the people won't turn against him. They need me here. <sighs> You're sure? I have lived as an Athenian. And I will die as an Athenian. Then do something for me, both of you. Of course. Retrieve Phoebe's body. Give her a proper burial. Everything she deserves, and more. Thank you. Time to go, Cassandra. And I expect to see you both again, alive.
The farther we get from Athens, the quieter it grows. As though it's peaceful. But I know better. I'm sorry, Aspasia. About Pericles. And Athens. You have no need to apologize. For anything. It feels like... I let everyone down. I didn't get to them quick enough. I didn't make the right decisions. It's not your fault. There's no one to blame but the cult of Cosmos. I'll make each of them beg for mercy before I kill them. That time will come. For now, let us look to the future. Do you have a heading? I was hoping you would help me with that. Yes, of course. This woman, Phinecas. Her ship was called Siren Song. Phinecas. Yes, I know the name. Last anyone heard, her ship was docked on the island of Naxos. <sighs> then we go to Naxos to see Phinecas.